Hello and welcome back. We're heading out to find out who among the resistance is working for Skynet. I don't know. Seems like he didn't join up for the <clears throat> excellent healthcare, so... Or maybe that's a Terminator robot. Uh, that's uh, my guess. Or maybe, maybe no one. Maybe there's some other explanation. We shall see. Commander Baron wants me to find the team of messengers that gave the order that sabotaged our defense systems. They are equipped with GPS trackers and it seems they are keeping a lookout near the warehouse district area. Okay. But if they betrayed me, then, you know, betrayed us, the resistance, they might just, uh, just get rid of their GPS trackers. <clears throat> During this mission, exact locations of your targets are not displayed. However, there are two signal strength indicators on the upper left corner of your HUD. Increasing percentage value indicates that you are moving towards the target. Decreasing value indicates that you are moving away from the target. Yeah, yeah fine, fine, fine. Okay, I'm seeing two. So, I, I, so we got trackers. two targets. Who should be our guys? Two guys what the here. Hell are they doing here? We're gonna find More them. More no plasma problem. containers. Looks like Skynet's here for good. Oh, spiders! Bloody spider bots! What the hell? The spider decided to hide. Crafting table. I don't really need to craft anything. I can craft some ammo. Okay then. Can we go inside? No. Go! Just, yeah, do that. <clears throat> Get out my super sniper. <gasps> this, this is never gonna run out of ammo. Uh oh. Flamethrower! If I could get close enough to take a picture. Why? You want to go close to the flamethrower guy? Uh, to take a picture? Oh shit. Quality good and bad. Okay, fine. Pretty good gun. Just take everything they got. He fell on the regular Terminator, but I can't loot him now. Oh no, he's somewhere else. Ah, uh, sure. There's nothing here. Terminators. I'm supposed to take a picture of this guy? Oh man. Oh shit. It's a fl flamethrower guy too. Am I really supposed to take a picture of that idiot? Why? Good enough needs to be perfect. Why? Oh shit! Oh my god. Looks like because I pumped my uh, damage res resistance, we can take one more hit. But that's that's for four points. Oh my god. It's 
this is not a great weapon. Okay, then. Fire rate. I think that could be useful. Yeah, we can't really mess that up. Not good enough. Needs Come to be on. perfect. Seriously? Why do you want to take a fucking picture of it? Wait. Did I pick up a one that's good? That's a... Did I pick up a damage link? I got a fire rate link? I don't think so. Are we gonna just investigate it after maybe this mission? Photo good. Not good enough needs to not good enough needs to be perfect. Why does it need to be perfect? Got it. What kind of quest is this? Very nice picture. Like, why do I need a fucking picture of it? Like, it's just a robot with a flamethrower. We can't imagine something like that. How could they have a flamethrower? How would that work? Take all the stuff. Oh, I guess we can save and usually this have uh, crafting benches as well. Yeah, always a crafting bench nearby. Maybe a box. We can interact with the box. I'm not a huge fan of that. If you if you have a box, you know, just let the player open the fucking box, you know. If you don't want to put a box down, then just don't put a box down. But like, putting down containers that cannot be opened, kind of bullshit. That's a big turret. Can we... Can we mess with that? We can't. Or can we? I can't. I can. Easy. It's just hard to get close to it. Give me XP. I got 19 XP for it. Sure. Maybe some uh, robots show up this way, then we gotta be good. Oh! I... We know about this place already. Heated. Thanks for the assist. Okay. It says charged. We can we can apparently charge this rifle. No, oh fuck me. I gotta run away, because I need to heal up. It's not possible to charge it. It fires instantly when I press the button. It doesn't fire when I, when I release the button, it, it fires when I press the button. There's just no way. Unless, I don't know how would you charge it. Okay. Doing all these mini games. So, I already explored this place. So maybe I don't want to explore it again. 
sure it's a good map. Don't get me wrong. But I'm not sure if there's like a point to exploring it again. Signal strength. Terminator. Okay. So I just hack it. It's gonna save us some time. Also might uh, save us extra time because it kills stuff. Good enough. Hacking success. No! Is that like a. Yeah, there is. Oh man. Is one of the signals this way? Is that being critical? Double critical damage would help us. Oh, it seems like it's harder to hack it once it saw me. Oh, it moves faster. So hard now. No, it's hard to for real. Okay. Good. No! Crap. Doable. I think there was another Terminator this way. Maybe we can deal with that. No point coming in here. Oh, yeah. When I was last here last time, I couldn't lockpick this. But I already looted the entire place, so it doesn't really matter. I very much suspect the signals are not gonna be at the same place. Okay, that's a uh, green. What is this? Yeah, find the radio for Ryan. Oh no. Okay. Come to me, spiders. I don't know if you can survive one of these now. Uh, with the damage resistance that I managed to acquire. Yeah, whatever. I don't really need to loot it. Am I getting closer to it? Apparently one of them might be here. Because we are making some good progress. But, but before that, uh, let's just do Ryan's quest. We're going farther away from it. What's that music? What music? It seems to be coming from here. Oh, for fuck's Upstairs. Sake. Oh, let's just open the door first. Oh no. What if I try to take this out? <clears throat> Looks like there's another enemy out there. No? Never mind that. 
Apparently no. Okay. Oh, there is some music here. Is it upstairs? I can barely hear it. Alright. I hear some tunes. <laughs> okay, that's not the stairs upstairs. Who left this here? Oh shit, it's probably a trap. It does some seem like it. Seems like a Terminator trap to me. But hey, what do I know? Oh shit. Oh shit, finally. Okay. about another one. That one has less health. So that's good enough. Any more Terminators around here? Chemical compounds. Better be worth it, Ryan. It was running? Great. Alright. Ooh, a hard lock. No. We got it. Oh, leveled up to 20. Pretty nice. Let's see what we get. <clears throat> My toughness is maxed. We can go for weapons 4, which makes upgrades 20% more effective, and also makes reload faster. Okay. I think that's gonna be more useful than explosives for now. I like explosives a lot, but let's just see what kind of effect it has on my loadout. So, for example, this deals only this much damage? That's just... what the hell. So, this is 75 plus 40, and this is uh, 550 plus 363. So, we go for this upgrade. Um, let's see what we got. 44, so 10% increase in the bonus only. And again, 10% increase in the bonus only, which makes sense because this one gives a 10% increase in the bonus, and this gives a 20% increase in the bonus. We also get faster reload speed, which is just kind of pointless, but doesn't really matter. So I'm gonna go for two explosives, and I don't know what else. Actually, we should just go for crafting. Yeah, one crafting, two explosives, one crafting, and after that, we're gonna go for uh, some weapons action and uh, toughness action. I don't know, kind of depends on what we're gonna go for, I don't know. Crit damage doubled makes the headshots crazy. But toughness, you know, I mean, I think this is more, this is better. We shall see. Kind of depends. So, now that I've come this way, we are 81, 82% close to signal A. Let's just call it signal A. I looked at this. I'm running towards signal A. What? Very tanky spider. Oh shit. I probably shouldn't forget that I'm just taking no cover at all. Tanky spider. Wait, not dead yet? Not 
let's fix that. So we are super close. Oh, there is a turret inside. This is not the way to go. 87. The event up by 2 percentage. So I think it's pretty likely that it is this way. The signal's getting stronger. He should be somewhere around here. Come on. Easy plasma turret. Let's hack it. Cool. Alright. Uh, this is done. And see what else we got here. Oh. God damn it. He's not having the best time. We've made it to the rendezvous point, but we haven't had any contact with uh, Commander Baron. Why would she send us here? This day is getting uh, weirder and weirder. With zero radio communication, this place is getting lonely. God damn it, Gomer. How long does it take for you to piss? Okay. They Check took his blood. radio. Baron was right. Skynet's listening. What about Time the to look at the guy? second tracker. Oh, well, I guess we're taking everything. Well, they definitely uh, changed this place a little bit. Uh, we gotta go this way. This is where the tracker is. Second soldier. Oh shit. You die now, okay. We need more damage. A little bit more damage and we might be able to one-shot then. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Right, that kind of works on that guy, but... He's weak. He's one of the weaker ones. I need more damage! Okay... We're getting close. Not so long ago, I couldn't even touch Terminators. Now I'm just one-shotting them. We're complaining about not being able to one-shot them. Mm. Oh, fuck. Oh, crap. Oh, shit. We need, we need some uh, explosives here. Enjoy that. And I'm running away. He's dead. Okay. Not useful. Oh, fuck. Whoa, 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 what? It's a bad shot. Come on. their stuff so what we got <clears throat> map am I going the right way the signal is going up all by by one rest in peace the rolling bombs I do like the ships flying by. Oh fuck. Another storage facility. They keep popping up. If I take care of it, that might slow them down a little. Go behind cover. Ah, uh, see a uh, Terminator 2. Hit the fence. I just take. Oh, fuck, another one. I 
I hit the fence again. What's with the beeping? I think I'm getting closer. Uh, it's oh, got yeah, the to be here. Okay, fine. They got him too. No! Oh, his goggles look intact. Let's see the last picture he took. What, really? The infiltrator. It's back. Baron was right. Commander! Talk to me. Commander! They're dead. Everything turned out the way you said it would. Copy that. Get out of there. Uh, sure, I'll, I'll, I'll get out. I'll just, I'll just get in. Oh my, that's not good. Oh my god, what? This, this is a tough one. Oh my god, that's, that's tough. How am I supposed to do this? No, 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 the timing is very specific. How do I brute force it? Let's just brute force it when I'm out of attempts. Okay. How do we do this? So this goes away. And there, there is a, a path here, but it, it's, it's very specific. Okay. I need to actually, you know, wait and analyze it. If I just wait, that's, that's, you know, while I'm riding it, that's not a good idea. Fuck. Fuck. That, that was very close. No! Oh, it got pulled up. No! We need to figure out our Can I just hack it again? Wow, I can. Then if we got a different one. Fuck, let's brute force it with some trash. Stability. Let's do it. Next move. Fuck yeah. Let's meet at the docks. Get there as soon as possible. Over and out. I don't care about, you know, using some money. Why would she give out our Skip location? That. Because she's the traitor? She's the one? Oh my god. I'm not blind, by the way. I'm just like... The weapon's swinging. Too far away. Okay, let's just hide. Okay, well, I'm a little bit cheesing, but I also die very fast, so I don't feel too bad about it. Okay. A familiar place. But not that way now. Oh. What's with all the boxes? No. Why? Okay. Checkpoint. No. God damn it. Fucked up. Why game? Even the the first one was a little bullshit. Okay, we just need to rush, rush through. 
Not like we even get a lot of good stuff. Just like, whatever. Okay. We're not going this way. Uh. Okay. Well, seemingly we just blow it up. Oh. Violet plasma cells. This is the ammo for the last weapon. Okay. Okay. At this point, I'm just not even using the old weapons, so... Like, having ammo for them is... is kinda pointless. Well, whatever. Heck, medium. Ugh. Alright. Let's do this. Okay. I'm just gonna be more eager to rush through. I know I'm running. Plasma storage destroyed. Plasma storage destroyed. Now proceed with your mission. He says it in a way that he wants to sound cool. Wait, what? I can go either way? Hunting season? Or hunting season? It, it seemingly doesn't matter. But does it? Okay, I, I guess we can... We can just leave this area. Either way. Fine. Fine by me. <laughs> oh, we need to reload the rifle. And just watch out. For any Terminators. Especially spiders. They just come up like, hey, you wanna die? Like, no, not particularly, no. Okay. Game saved. We are very close to the exit, maybe. <sighs> it was like just doing solo missions, like, oh yeah, Baron is telling me to do everything, but maybe Baron's gonna be the the Terminator. Somebody is the Terminator. Come on. And just because I I cannot think that they are not the Terminator, someone's gonna be it, right? Jennifer uh, wanted to be a part of the hideout, but like she's most likely not. I'm I'm like I'm very likely one. Uh, Baron could be one. Obviously, we got at least I don't know. Very likely, we got more than one. You're still alive. Good. Apparently, Skynet's got a real hard on for you, so we figured why not use you as bait. Aren't you afraid that Skynet will bring a lot of firepower if they know we're both here? Afraid? No. Prepared for that eventuality? Yes. We've got eyes on the ambush site from every angle. If anyone shows up, it means they were listening. What if it's one of our guys, or just a scavenger? Too bad. We can't have anyone or anything sabotage our plan. Not this time. This time? We were very close once before. For years, we've been preparing for the final attack. But it took just one man to fuck everything up. That day, Perry... Our previous field commander died, and I inherited control of South Division. Since then, I've been making sure that no one fucks up again. We've got movement. Take position. Seems like a dodgy plan, I have to say. What do you have? A hooded man's walking down the street. Might be a scavenger. There's no scav. You saw him. Is it the same model? Is it the infiltrator? I can't tell. We're waiting for your signal. I think that might be it. You think? Good enough for me. Cease fire! Cease fire! Target down! I repeat, target down! Go check him! Eyes on the target. Proceed with caution. It looked flashy to dead? me. What the fuck? It's the target! It can't get away. Fire at will. Never mind that. Oh shit! That, that's not how I He's in the do open. things. It's in the open. It's a fucking machine. Okay. Looks 
was hiding behind that. Okay, that's smart. I'm just gonna come over this way. Pick up some stuff. Try to get angle on him. I can't. Where the fuck is he? He's hiding over here. Wow, he's 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 damn tanky. Is it time to do some drugs? Speed stimulant. Okay, let's do some. What else? Pain killing. Slow mo. Let's do slow mo too. Oh fuck! What did I do? No, no, that's not what I wanted. Slow mo. Yeah, that's the one I want. Just do all the drugs. What else we want? Uh, we can just uh, throw some regular grenades at him. He might like that. Or might not like that. Um, okay. How about some grenades for you? It bounces back. Okay. What if I just snipe him in the head? Did that work? Oh, he's... he's, he's one tanky boy. It's backed against the wall. We've got it now. Okay, let's not use that. What oh, he's the fuck? Running away. That okay. Plan. Oh no no, that we should just stick with Everyone the plan. On me. That's that's a decent plan. Okay, we see him. He's running away. It's carrying a second generation plasma rifle. I want it. it no, I want die. it. I'm calling dibs on that shit. Wh whoever kills it, uh, gets it, okay? He just like calling dibs on that already. Okay. Get a little closer. Oh no, he wants me. He doesn't get knocked down. I guess it's I'm gonna move. reload. He is? He is. Alright. We are Take cover. damn eager to run after him. Not the best idea. Where is he though? Where is he? <gasps> no! I'm dead? Oh my fucking god. That's what I said! I can't believe it. Some idiot got me killed. Oh shit. Let's go back. It won't fucking die! Shoot! Okay. How do we kill him? What's the most effective way to kill him? What if I throw like the biggest explosions at him? How about that? And he's a Terminator, so any kind of physical weapon is probably gonna be useless. So. Pretty big explosion. Oh, he doesn't care at all. Does it even hurt him? Is this better? Peekaboo! Oh man! Did you die? Let's see if the grenade hurts him. Nope. He doesn't care at all about the grenade. Cool. I guess we're gonna replace it and not use the grenade. Maybe I should just do this in my curve. It's on Where's the move! Hit? 
Okay. Guys, let's go. But be careful. Take cover! And I have all the damage reduction I can I can pack. And even like that I got one shot at. So that's kinda bullshit. <laughs> Not like something that I could foresee. The fucking shit! Game, this is bullshit. You can't just send me the like insta-kill rockets. And no one else is getting them, only I got it. Oh, I know. We gotta do the drugs that makes me take less damage. Yeah, I got it. Not now, but then we pass through. Speed stimulant? Painkilling? Yeah, painkilling stimulant. Maybe that's gonna work. I don't fucking know. It won't fucking die! But it's a plan. Shoot! Die. Oh my fucking god, I hate you. Okay, I'm just gonna chill in the back. I don't know. I don't know how much HP he has, probably like... Oh. Taking no damage at all. At least 20,000. Probably more than that. If every Terminator was so tough, we would have zero chance. It's on the move! Okay, running away. I will trigger my drug. Take cover! Can I just I died to the rockets. Okay. Going back doesn't work. Open fire! But that's that's my instinct. That you know, when you that's get hit by rockets, you don't bitch. rush forward. Usually. That's the plan here. Okay. It's one tanky boy. This is the only other weapon I can use. I barely even see him like this. God damn it. I think the sniper is better. Oh, actually, that's not what I wanted. I wanted heal. Give me the heals. And just go switch into sniper for now. Where is he? Die. God damn it. Maybe I should go for. Uh, body shots. <laughs> he dodged it. Critical body shot. It might never matter against the Terminators. Not again! Follow it! Yeah, I mean, okay. You guys go first. What else we see here? Nothing. What a big fight. It's inside! Inside? Maybe like standing in the doorway? Inside? Wow. Apparently he's taking critical hits. But it doesn't really care. Okay, he disappeared. Let's throw it around. Rivers! Oh, I guess that's how we do it. <laughs> Rivers, we're trying to get through. You can't let it get away, you hear? Well, easier said than done. I can do that too. I can do that too, that's cool. Okay, we go away now. How much damage I can deal to him? 
Not much. If I keep this up, he's gonna be dead in a minute or two. I mean, fair enough, this is a boss fight. I'm sick of my nonsense. I don't have much choice, I have to take cover. Terminator. Okay. Commander. Dibs on the weapon. We got it. We finally got it. Good job, Rivers. Woo. Stay there. We're on our way. Sergeant Rivers. The hero of the resistance. In every way. <clears throat> the infiltrator has finally fallen. Its hyper alloy combat chassis was much more resistant than before. Our weapons were um, outmatched. We could barely handle one of them on its own. We won't stand a chance against an army of them. But the real reason the infiltrator was Skynet's best weapon yet was because of its skin. Yeah, but not really his manners. Oh, we got him on... There was no doubt anymore. Nice. Let's see that. Skynet had created a cybernetic organism. It was designed to blur the line between a man and a machine. People started to think that there were Terminators amongst us. Wolves in sheep's clothes. Some of us left. Even though we hadn't seen any other infiltrators yet. Or at least, we didn't think we had. And that fear of not knowing was what turned the tide of this war. That night, Skynet won. Uh, I still have to run some tests, so f for now I would say no. We need some more time, Connor. I know you don't want to hear this, Commander, but if there's one person who can help us, it's Dr. Mack. Mack? It, we don't even know if he's alive. He is. He's in the Hollywood Hills. We knew a time would come when we'd need him again, so we've kept an eye on him. Wait. You've been watching him without telling me? let your emotions cloud your judgment before, Commander. That's why I decided that Max's whereabouts were no longer this your This is bullshit. Concern. He can't just magically fix all of our problems. He's a man, not a god. A man that makes that's mistakes. That's enough, Commander. You know what happened last time. He's the reason Perry's dead. I said that's enough. Sergeant Rivers? Yes, sir. Techcom believes that being marked for termination is a badge of honor. A sign that we're doing something right. We wear it proudly. And knowing you're wearing such a badge, Rivers, is all I need to trust you with handling this mission. Commander Baron will fill you in on the details. Good luck, soldier. Over and out. Yeah, but that's their list. Looks like you're going to Hollywood Hills. Dr. Edwin Mack is the one who taught us how to use Skynet's weapons. So there's a chance he can do it again. Take him that second generation plasma rifle and see if he's able to reprogram it. If we want to use Skynet's weapons, we need to bypass their encryption lockouts. How will I find him? He's obsessed with surveillance. So when you get there, look for any cameras, biometric sensors, or any other tech stuff. He should be around. That's it. Cool. Twenty-one! New skill point! What's gonna be the new skill? Oh, it can be explosives. It can be crafting. It should be explosives, come on. I love explosives, but there is a problem with... The only problem with explosives is that... A lot of units are resistant to explosives. But if they are not exp uh, resistant to it, then yeah, I mean, it's pretty damn good. I don't know what I should go for. Like, we can also go for crafting, but like... Eh. 
It's crafting. All right, let's go for the explosives. Blow stuff up. We can go explosives too. And, I don't know, some crafting. Whatever. Mm, yeah. I got a lot of stuff here. Probably I should just sell some of them. Mainly. Wait, what? Can I take this? Okay. Uh, make sure that guy's dead. After careful analysis, I've come to the conclusion that uh, under a microscope, the infiltrator's skin is indistinguishable from a human epidermis. They have approximately the same amount of nerve endings as humans. The skin is covered with hair fo uh, follicles and sweat glands are functional. For all intents and purposes, the terminator's skin a terminator skin could be categorized as living tissue. It is advised that we learn more about how the skin reacts to various forms of stimuli. Perhaps the results could provide us with an idea of how to distinguish between terminators and humans. What is even more impressive is its cardiovascular system, or should I say, vascular system, considering the infiltrators do not possess an organic heart. Heart. The pumping of the blood is carried out by a mechanical circulatory system, which is also responsible for filtering the blood. The cell count is nearly identical to that of humans. Its blood is a form of biofluid and should be handled with care. It is imperative that we avoid contaminating the sample. Okay, cool. Alvin, what do you say about this? Sure, let's trust someone who gets called Dr. Death. That won't bite us in the ass. Not in the meantime, I'll see what I can learn from the new CPU we acquired from that infiltrator. This could be the breakthrough that we've all been waiting for. <clears throat> I need to concentrate, so please don't disturb me. Maybe he's a Terminator. Probably not. What do you need? The chat. Oh, Baron's story? Is Mac the one whose drone you smashed? Was Mac the one whose drone you smashed? Yes. Yes, it was. I've never told this to anyone, but... Before I met Mac and Perry, I was wandering alone. Didn't have a map, so I drew one myself. The first people I came across were two guys. Old enough to remember Judgment Day. We camped out together. They gave me advice, we shared some stories. Sounds nice, right? A little... See, there are still good people out there. See, there are still good people out there. <laughs> they weren't good. Although, not cutting my throat in my sleep makes them more or less gentlemen. When I woke up, all my things were gone, including my map. There I was, lost in the desert. Thirst and hunger. I knew I was gonna die. I passed out with my face in the sand. But next thing, I was lying in a bed, bathed and wearing clean clothes. You're lucky someone found you. Actually, she may have died in the desert and got replaced by a Terminator. <laughs> that's, that's what I'm going with. You're lucky someone found you. Someone did find me. Too bad it was Skynet. Through the window, I saw thousands of Terminators. First, I thought it was a work camp, but it was something else. A Skynet research facility. They kept me alive, but I didn't know why. I thought I was the only human there. But after a while, someone came into my cell. A man. Well-dressed, clean-shaven. You want to take a guess who that was? One of those guys who robbed you? Your cellmate? An infiltrator? Your cellmate? Your cellmate? No. He was there out of his own free will. He was a traitor to his race. Bastard was selling every piece of knowledge the machines didn't have. In return, they gave him everything he wanted. When he was done stuffing his face with food, he had another request. He wanted a whore. 
It lasted months, until I got to wrap a towel around his neck and make his eyes pop. Oh, turning away, I like that. You don't want to see people for what they really are. I've seen their true face. That traitor, those two guys in the desert, Mac. They all showed it to me. It's not pretty. The truth is, the only reason I fight for the resistance is because I despise people just a little less than the machines. That's true. There are some bad people out there, you know. People are the best and the worst. That's just how it goes. Anything I should uh, know about Dr. Mac? Um, anything I should know about Dr. Mac before I leave? Only that he can't be trusted and he's highly manipulative. So you need to stay cautious. Fair enough. Oh. Jacob, do you have a minute? Of course. I've heard that you're going to Hollywood Hills. Well, with Baron yelling like that, the whole shelter heard. He wanted me to tell you if I needed anything, so here it is. When you get to Hollywood Hills, could you stop by my old house? It's near the Griffith Park tennis courts. I wonder if Peter went there and left something for me. I know he'd be stupid to go there since now it's behind the Annihilation line, but then again, he was always full of stupid ideas. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. Oh, fair enough. Look at him. He never talks to anyone. He just sits there. Who? I bet he's one of those machines. Oh, man. Oh! Yeah, the radio. I don't even get the chance to, like, give it to them. You just, like, you just have it. He just has it. Jacob. Uh, you mentioned a new era starting? Earlier, you said that a new era started. What changed? Well, for one thing, with Tucker dead, I became the new leader of the group. Something I never expected or wanted, for that matter. Did everyone agree that you should be the leader? Did everyone agree that you should be the new leader? Oh, not everyone. We had a huge fight about food, or where we should go next, and so on. Our group divided without Tucker to keep it together. I was terrified. I started to walk away like I was on autopilot. I don't know if I wanted to run away or to kill myself, but, but then something surreal happened. I found a metal door in the ground in the middle of nowhere. I was real unsure about what I might find under it, but what I did find was the aftermath of a massacre. More Terminators? Oh my god. These dumb prompt questions instead of like, you know, yeah, yeah, just go on, whatever. He's just telling me a story, and like, after every sentence, I'm like, I'm just guessing in it. <laughs> it was like, more Terminators? More Terminators? That's exactly what I thought at first, but it turned out to be something even more scary. It looked like they decided to commit suicide. I couldn't understand it. To me, they had everything. Food, water, they even had a case of beer. So, I got shit-faced and started crying over my brother's death. But I realized something. I realized that I could maybe survive there. Did you stay there by yourself? That's kind of sm smart in a way. Did you stay there by yourself? No. I told everybody about the place. I felt I owed them. After that, we were all right. That night, I learned two things. Firstly, that it's okay to be scared. Secondly, that there are two sides to everybody. Ironically, me being a scaredy cat turned me into a good leader. And that's how I found that place, and that's what motivated me to help others. But Tucker, well, he was a leader from the start. 
but he had an ugly side too. He killed those who opposed him. Wow. He was a real scumbag, but he was my brother. He made me want to be a good person for the both of us. Our hangover wasn't a high price to pay for that lesson. I hate to say this, but, you know, your brother was not as good as you kind of portrayed him as. Kill people who post them? Holy shit. Uh, what's the situation like in the shelter? What's the situation like in the shelter? Not that great. People are getting nervous. A lot have already left and even more plan to leave. Even Mark and Laura saw them packing earlier. And what about you? Uh, just the thought of running again is making me sick. Must be getting old. Plus, we got everything we can need right here. Where else would I go? Besides, I have faith that Baron would never let anything happen to this place. She's way too upset about security. Yeah, this place is not that great. I mean... She's, she's keeping it together, but like, let's be real here. I mean... This is just a hole with like 20 people inside it. And uh, if the machines came here, like... It would be like a free buffet. Oh, is she going away or what? No way. Jacob, I didn't see you there. Is everything okay? Where's Patrick? Oh, she's going to find Patrick. Is everything okay? You seem far away. Nothing can get past you, can it? I've been thinking about the day we met. I never told you how we really ended up there. You can tell me anything. You don't have to if you don't want to. Ooh, I, I like both answers, but... I like both. Well, that's, a, that's a good question. I, I could say both. You don't have to tell me. But you can also tell me anything. I don't know. Let, let's go with that, because I would rather hear it. <laughs> oh, man. You can tell me anything. I know I can. That's why you're the first person I'm telling this to. That day, loud hammering woke me up. When I came downstairs, I saw my father nailing the window shut. Through the crack, I saw them coming. Hundreds of metal heads and their red eyes. Even though they're just empty shells, I could feel the hate radiating from them. And your father was making noise? Uh, what did you do? What did you do? I made Patrick stay upstairs and went back to talk to my father. We argued for a minute or two and I tried to pull him away from the window. He pushed me away. I tried it again, but he shoved me. And this time I fell. I didn't recognize him as he was reaching for a shotgun. He said, I shouldn't worry about the machines, they wouldn't hurt us. I don't even remember how. But the gun was already in my hands. I closed my eyes and went someplace else. Didn't even hear the shot. I didn't hear Patrick's steps either. He saw you? He saw you? He did. He was staring at me like I was a stranger. He didn't scream or cry, he just stared. I threw the gun away, grabbed Patrick, and tried not to notice the hole in my father's unmoving chest. As we ran, I could hear them coming, so we found somewhere to hide. Then you came. I wanted to tell someone about all this, but I was afraid to. You're right, you probably shouldn't tell this to people, because most of them are going to judge you. Like crazy. I'm glad you did. I could say both. I'm glad you did. I am too. We talk a lot about how heartless the machines are. And I started to think that maybe I was too. I probably would have convinced myself of that if it wasn't for you keeping me sane. Wow. Thank you for everything. 
I never thought I would find a friend in times like these. Where's Patrick? Where are you going? Where's Patrick? He's getting ready. I'm taking him with me. I figure it's time for him to see what's out there. What? Where are you going? Are you going to die? <laughs> why, why? This is not a time for like some, some family vacation. Where are you going? I'm going out scavenging. Don't worry. I'm past thinking about running away. Knowing how much you'd miss me made me not want to leave. Okay. So... We gotta find Mac. And possibly Erin's husband. Is it, is, it, is it true? True? I can look human now? What? Oh, yeah. What's with the I mean, dog? We could have like a uh, full vault. Been like that ever no, since not, they not really brought that like thing in. Full of machines. Where's the other doggy? Usually we have two doggies here. Kind of like the gun. Can I get it? Anyway, guys, uh, that's for now. Thanks for watching. And uh, to, well, next time we're gonna head out to Hollywood Hills. So, yeah. See ya.